so much for tuning in and watching another video. In this video, this is going to be episode two of my natural hairstyles for short curly hair or medium uh, length hair. So I want to show you another hairstyle. Uh, this is called the twist and low. So like I said, I want to give my hairstyle some names and give it some character. So this one is called the twist and low for the obvious reasons. So basically with this particular ha hairstyle, I have twisted my hair, just did a full twist out from the front to the back. Um, what I did is when I took my twist down, I took my twist, uh, unraveled my twist halfway, about mid of my hair back, and I just simply pinned it around with bobby pin while the top of my hair remains twisted at the top. So basically this twist out goes into a low puff. And here's the back. So I just want to show you guys how I create this look. If you would like to see how I brought this look all together and what products I use to achieve this hairstyle, stay tuned and keep watching. The products I'll be using to achieve this look will be the new Garnier Fructis, Pure Clean Detangler plus Air Dry plus Aloe Extract. I'll also be using Smooth and Shine Polishing Curl Up Curl Activating Mousse with Jojoba Oil. Both of these products will help to eliminate and prevent frizz. Alright guys, let's get started. So I'm just going to start by parting my hair into sections, starting from the back. And I'm just going to spray each section. And I'm just going to work it in really well. Next, we'll take the mousse. And we'll work the mousse also from the root of your hair to the ends. I'm going to brush it through. And we'll begin twisting. Y'all, this feels so amazing on my hair. My hair feels so soft, so moisturized, and it is making my curls pop just with these two products alone. Definitely giving some really great definition. So we're just going to repeat this process until we are completed. hoping that when it dries it doesn't you know feel crunchy or anything like that I'm hoping that it doesn't but it is have it my hair feels very moisturized very soft I mean just these two products alone had my curls popping like they were like yes for the moisture in this hair so what I'm gonna do is after I pin everything backwards I'm going to tie it down and I won't take it down until um, tomorrow morning. It should be fully dry. The bobby pins are just helping to hold my hair back the way I want it. I want everything straight back. 
All right, now you know we gotta get them edges. You know, I can't, I can't lay this down without, without getting these edges. So I'm gonna use a little Eco Styler Gel around my edges. I'm not gonna do my edge control. I will wait. So I'll, I'll wait until my final um, style when I'm when I'm finalizing my style, and I'll use my edge control then. But I'm not gonna use it right now. So again, this style is called Twist and Low for the obvious reasons. It'll be twisted in the front and low uh, puffed out in the back. So I can't wait to see the final results. I hope it's gonna look the way I want it to look. I'm hoping. <laughs> we shall find out together. All right, I'm gonna start lining the edges up first. Cause you know, we gotta lay that down first. Make it a little loose a little bit. I don't want it too tight around my head. And I'll get my bonnet and just put on there for just some extra protection. Just keep the frizz down as much as possible. And I'm just going to go to sleep on this and I will see you guys tomorrow. I'm gonna take it all down. We're gonna style it and see how the outcome is. So until then, Lord willing, I will see you in the morning. Bye guys. So it is the next day and we're going to go ahead and take this down. All right. Very sleek. <laughs> Very sleek. Slick down to my head. All right, so I'm just gonna take the bobby pins out. All of them out. And then I'm going to unravel my hair from the back about midway up. And then I'm gonna to start to place the bobby pins where I want them to go. I will say my curls feel very soft, very smooth, no crunch at all. There's no cast, there's not even a cast on my hair. So just unraveling just the back portion. Who would have thought that two random products very inexpensive products would give me this type of texture, make my hair feel this smooth and this soft. more separating. Don't want to do too much because I don't want it to be turned into a big old frizz ball. And to finish up the look, we're just going to follow it up with the edge control to complete it. My edges are pretty flat already from the uh, Eco Styler Gel, but I guess I just want a little extra hold. Okay, And I'm just going to take my handy dandy edge control toothbrush <laughs> and I do not use this to brush my teeth for people that for people that may be watching and wonder why is she using a toothbrush and the hair community among black women we need to slick those edges down sometimes a big hairbrush won't do it just to kind of really get in there you need a toothbrush and this is only used for those purposes it's just for your hair and to get that baby hair slip down, flatten down of how you want it. Cause a big old hairbrush ain't, won't be able to accomplish, a big hairbrush won't be able to accomplish that. So that's the end of the video guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you like watching me do this second hairstyle and I hope it's something that you'll be able to try and I hope that you like it as well. If you like this video, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And also don't forget to turn on your notifications so you'll be notified of upcoming videos that will be coming your way. It's Just Janine. I will see you guys on the next video. Bye guys.